What? What's going on, guys? Taco here. And today we are back on the Let's Play account. And uh, as you can see, I've made quite a bit of progress. Our army camps are maxed out for this town hall level. So is our barracks. And I think that our elixir storages are going to be maxed out for this town hall level as soon as they finish in one hour. I'm sorry I won't be able to record that tonight because I am exceptionally tired and I need to go to work tomorrow. So, that being said, apologies. You will get to see it tomorrow in the next video, blah, blah, blah. But I'm going to continue playing on this account and be getting as many gains as we can off screen. But as you can see there, we can hold 60,000 elixir and 22,000 gold. As soon as these are done, I think I'll be able to hold over... I'll definitely be able to hold over 100,000. I think I'll be able to hold nearly 200,000 elixir, if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me on that. I could be completely wrong and full of it. But we also got a couple of achievements off camera. We did manage to get released the Beast, so that's cool. We got Wallbuster as well, and we also got Conquer, so that's cool. A few more gems. We are up to 341, well on our way to that third builder which is very exciting stuff indeed. Now, we are almost done with this town hall level. As soon as we got here, we're already almost ready to leave. We do need to upgrade our elixir collector, our gold mine, our gold storages, and we also still need to buy the mortar, the bombs, and I believe... What else was there? And a, an elixir collector and a gold mine. And then we will be ready to progress to town hall level four but before we do that we got to max out our walls and we need to max out the laboratory now that's exactly why we are recording tonight because i wanted to upgrade my barbarians but i wanted you guys to be here with me when we hit the button so let's do that now one two three barbarians beautiful our barbarians will be upgraded in six hours so that's nothing at all no time at all now, I know that on my main account, Taco Mountain, it takes like 14 days to upgrade a troop now. And that is ridiculous. Now, I'm actually not going to do any raiding on tonight's episode because I wanted to do something else. I remembered that I told uh, Aztec Warrior that if he three-starred in the last war, that I would put it on this episode. And he did it. Aztec Warrior did manage to get a three-star victory. Now, I'm not sure if the princess did. Let's check if princess... Princess didn't even get to attack. She, she must have been a busy little princess. But let's go check out Aztec Warrior's attack on 24. Because that's one higher than 25. So there we go. Let's check out his attack. Here we go. It's a very, very spread out base. And Aztec is coming in with the dragons. He's put in a few over on that side. To take out the clan castle. And to, as well to do some damage. And there he goes. He sends in the Hog Riders, and it's over. Nice attack, Aztec. I'm sorry the base wasn't more difficult for you, because that could have provoked... <clears throat> provoked? Provided? Provoked. It could have given more opportunity to a difficult war attack, and would have been a little bit funner for you and for us. But that was still a very good job, Aztec. I am very proud of you. Now, we're going to turn this into a little bit of a Let's Play slash lay and pipe let's see who else did good the queso cutie the cute one did utter destruction to this base we're gonna watch it in 4x mode see as you can see there we brought in the hog rider to lure the clan castle our witch managed to take our witch and queen together were managed to take out the clan castle we sent in the golem and the barb king to take out the defending barb king and we are just slowly sprinkling in some hogs as they migrate their way around that base as to prevent giant bombs from utterly utterly slaughtering our hog riders and while this is going we are going to come over here quickly and go with the say hi to youtube with the exclamation point beautiful check mark go perfect now nice attack me you did well you managed to get the three star victory it's too bad we came up just a little bit short this war. It would have been very cool if we managed to pull off the win, but sadly we did not. Now, Aztec, were you in this? Was big Aztec. Aztec the father. Was he in this war? Aztec KOA. He did manage to... Oh, that's not even fair, Aztec. Let's go watch Aztec's attack on their 23. Oh, you're such a bully, Aztec. <laughs> Let's see this. Let's see this. Oh, Aztec. Oh, you're dirty. 
Here he comes in with the quake spells. Manages to open up the entire base. Very bold strategy from the Aztec warrior here. A few witches and the archer queen and a couple wizards. And he does manage to pull out the three star victory. If we had more beautiful attacks like this, we would have won the war. Very nice attack, Aztec. Great job helping the team out. Pushing forward towards that war win. We just couldn't quite pull it off. Now we're going to check out an attack from Aztec. It looks like he uses, he attempted to use the hog rider, hog rider to lure, but he was prevented by those two annoying Tesla there. But he sends in the balloons wisely to pull the clan castle lure. And now he's pulling them up north with his heroes to destroy their faces. And then he spams in a few lava hounds backed up with some supporting balloons. And he does manage to just absolutely steamroll this base. Very nice attack, Mav. I am very proud of you. And you did a wonderful job with the complete destruction of this base. And that's awesome that that other hound managed to pop right before the final defense was destroyed. Look at all those pups that he had left. Very cool attack, Aztec. Nice job. Now, we have time for just one more attack. Taco Place says hi, say hi to YouTube. And it looks like Jazzy Jazz does get to say hi to YouTube. Hi, Taco. I could go for a nice big taco right now. Couldn't we all? I would absolutely love to eat a taco at the moment. Now, we're going to go check out Justin. Justin managed to pull off a very cool attack right here. Coming in with 17 bowlers and a bunch of healers. Now, it looks like he's making a very massive funnel with those bowlers and just forces everybody else to the core of the base. And the Archer Queen has very little difficulty taking out that defending uh, max level dragon. And the base is just completely steamrolled from that point forward. Those uh, bowlers never in question. They managed to just completely go through this base, taking very little damage and causing utter destruction. Very cool attack. HNIC, aka the Justin, aka the badass that managed to pull off the three star on their number five. But, anyways, very good war, guys. I'm proud of everybody. We are actually in a war right now. It's actually in prep day, 16 minutes to go until the war begins. Taco Plays is in the war. However, Taco's Plays is not going to be able to assist at all. It's a Town Hall 7, and uh, that bodes very difficult for a Town Hall 3. <laughs> so, we will just have to see where things go from there. I know that the Queso Cutie will get a 3-star or 2. But anyways, guys, that is going to do it for this episode. I know you didn't get to see me attack much, but you actually got to see a few interesting attacks. Good job to everybody in the previous war. I thought you all did a terrific job. It just couldn't quite come together, and we managed to have a 2-star loss. Hopefully, we can get it together. We don't go on that 3-loss losing streak. That will be very, very bad, and I will be quite upset. But I think that we can pull off this victory, guys. Anyways, let's get it together and let's pull off the win. But anyways, that's going to do it for this video. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel, uh, like the video, and leave me a comment. I love seeing those comments and I reply to all of them. But And also, remember that you can follow me on Facebook at facebook.com. You just search Taco Mountain Gaming. And I'll be the one with the big red beard. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for today. Remember that Taco loves you. And I've been Taco Mountain. You have been real. Thanks for watching. Hey, guys, we are back. And I just wanted to throw in a few people saying hi to YouTube after I was done recording. But we popped back in so that Nacho Daddy, Gunny B, and Aztec could all say hi to YouTube. Hi, guys. I'm glad you guys made it. You guys were a little bit late, but you made it anyway. And uh, happy birthday. But anyway, guys, that is now going to do it for the video. I've been Taco Mountain. You have been real. Thanks for watching.